Audio can be added to an Audacity project by recording new tracks as well as importing existing clips or music. To record, first plug in the microphone. We recommend using an external USB mic instead of a built-in laptop mic for better quality. Then, launch Audacity. Click the Recording Device drop-down, which has a mic icon next to it, and select the desired mic. If you're using a USB mic, it should appear here. If not, try restarting Audacity. In the next drop-down to the right, select Mono if you're only recording with one microphone. Next, click within the recording meter, which may be noted with Click to start monitoring. The meter should start to bounce to indicate that it's picking up audio from the mic. Say a few lines at a normal speaking volume and check the volume level. The ideal level is between negative 12 and negative 6 decibels, and the meter should turn yellow in this range. Use the recording level slider to increase or decrease the input volume as needed. You don't want the level too loud, nor too quiet. When ready, click the record button, which has a red circle. A new track will be added to the timeline for the recording. When done, click the stop button, which has a square. Don't click the pause button, as this will pause the entire program. Before making any edits, we recommend exporting a backup just in case the original, unaltered recording needs to be retrieved. To do so, go to File, Export, Export Audio. Rename the file. Choose a save location. Select either MP3 or WAV as the file type. And click Save. To import audio files such as music or other clips that are saved to your computer, go to File, Import, Audio. Locate and select the file, and then click Open. It will be added as a new track in the timeline. More information about Audacity can be found on our other videos, or by visiting the PLU Knowledge Base. If you need assistance, please feel free to reach out to Instructional Technologies.